Authorities are going to great lengths to identify the body of a little girl found in Texas. This is a 3D composite sketch of what they think she looked like, and detectives think she could be from right here in Arizona. 3TV's Donna Rossi is in our newsroom tonight with pretty fascinating police work that possibly connects this little girl here to Arizona, Donna. Well, the little girl's remains were found off Interstate 45 in a city called Madisonville. It's about halfway between Houston and Dallas. The National Center for Missing and Exploited Children released crime scene pictures and a video about the case today. The little girl's skeletal remains were found in a pasture inside a black suitcase wrapped in a couple of garbage bags. It's believed she was between two and six years old, Caucasian or Hispanic, with dark shoulder length hair. Pollen found on the little girl was analyzed and determined to likely be from southeastern Arizona. Now this is the composite sketch experts came up with of what the little girl may have looked like. The process of putting together a facial reconstruction, um, you know, it's a combination of art and science. Our forensic artists, prior to starting the reconstruction, they do consult with a forensic anthropologist from the Smithsonian. They go over the CT scan, look at photos of the skull, and really try to come up with what the, the child would have looked like in life. It's believed the little girl had been dead between three and five months when she was discovered in September of last year. The most unique feature that could help ID her is that she was found with a feeding tube due to a medical condition, so it was clear that she had been treated multiple times throughout her life by doctors. Reporting live in the newsroom, Donna Rossi, 3TV.